Hi, this is Brian with Local Pulse Marketing, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to update your YouTube business channel so that it looks legit and that you look uh, credible online, and and that your business page is all uh, set up and your business channel is all set up the way it should be. So I'm using a little uh, test dummy here. Uh, one of my clients I'm helping set up on YouTube, and what we're going to do first is, as you can see, I have my avatar here, but I want to show you exactly how to get there. So uh, first thing you're going to do is click on your down arrow here, and then you're going to go to settings. Once you click on settings, you're going to see this is exactly where you can change your avatar, okay? So now that we know that, let's head back to the channel. And what we're going to do is we're going to scroll over to the edit channel box right here. I'm going to show you how to update your website, your, your YouTube channel, excuse me. It's kind of like a website. So we're over here on the uh, basically the YouTube wizard, if you will. And what we're going to focus on first is the appearance. And you have the option actually to switch back to the old channel design if you'd like. Definitely if you choose. I kind of like the new style actually, so I'm going to keep it. But you can uh, look to actually update your avatar like I just showed you as well right here. Um, and then also you can look to basically choose an image for your background. You can do a custom YouTube image for your background. Or you can just choose to change color right here. And with these new channels, to be honest, I think they look slick enough just to change the color. Now, if you want to get some extra information on the side about your business, that's totally up to you. But uh, once you choose your color, make sure you hit accept. And once you hit accept, make sure you hit save up at the top or done editing, okay? So that's the first area of editing. The second area would be this info and settings section. And here is where you get to actually edit the title of the page if you'd like to change the title of your channel, your YouTube channel. And you can see that mine, <laughs> excuse me, Mine doesn't really make total sense right now at Custom Elegance TV's channel. I just want it to be Custom Elegance TV. So I'm going to erase that, and we should be good there. Uh, next, I have the opportunity to actually fill out a description. So I'm going to fill out a description, and I have it already pre-done over here. So I'm just going to copy-paste right into this box. Definitely recommend doing it ahead of time. It makes it a whole lot easier. And then uh, the last thing I'm going to do on this section is put in my tags. And the tags is basically, it's very important when it comes to YouTube. It's how YouTube basically identifies what your videos are about or what your channel is about here specifically. So I've uh, done a little bit of homework and figured out what uh, uh, we think are going to be good keywords, good tags for this channel. So we're going to drop, copy, and paste that in. All right. So next thing you have the opportunity to check this box and keep it checked if you want to make this channel visible to, on YouTube and I would definitely suggest keeping that if you want to get views on YouTube. The last thing over here is your default tab and you have three options. You have a feature tab, a videos tab, or a feed tab. And the feature tab only works if you have a video so definitely you need to have a video up on your YouTube channel. Uh, the videos tab would probably make sense to have videos as well. And the feed tab, if you don't have any videos yet, this is probably what you want to go with to start with, right? But let me show you what uh, the feature tab actually looks like on uh, the Local Pulse channel, right? So this is what the feature tab actually looks like. This is our featured video. You can see that it's, it's clicked off as the feature. This is what shows up by default. And you can see that uh, I'm going to show you how to get this cool, nice little template down here, or what we call a blogging template, okay? So let's go back to the setup. And we're good over here. You can have this one last checkbox. Always take subscribe users to the feed tab. Uh, that's up to you. Totally up to you. I like that, so let's keep it. All right. And the last thing we're going to do is check over at the feature tab, and we get to see the different layouts right here. And this one checked off right here is the one that I just showed you over here on Local Pulse Marketing. Our YouTube channel looks very clean. Let's call it it's vlogging. Uh, basically, uh, video vlog, vlog roll, blog roll, if you will. We have the creator over here, which is a little bit different. Um, you have little individual thumbnails here in the network. And here's a little bit of a mixture of the creator and the network over here in the everything. But I, again, I like the blogger. So I'm going to stick with that. I'm going to go ahead and you have the ability to enable the featured tab. Again, I wouldn't do that until you have a featured video. Okay. And that should be about it. So what you're going to do next is just hit done editing. And you should be good to go. You can see all my information here. And uh, we are good to go. So thanks, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.